1933. Uh, Louisiana shotgun double. It's built with ex Louisiana authentic materials. The first family that owned it was French. It was built to flood. It was built to continue living into it after the flood waters receded. We have plaster here. This house flooded once in 1995. The waters came up to the flo uh, floor, underneath of the floor, receded, we mopped it out and kept living in it. This time, uh, excuse me, in Katrina, there's the water line right there, excuse me. Um, again, nothing much happened. No mold and mildew because the lime and the plaster killed it all. So these people built with plaster walls, which prevents mold and mildew. Cypress, look at the cypress on the mail piece. The house is all cypress. Cypress lays, and it has hard pine floor that has so much pitch in it, I imagine. Nothing happened to the floor. So this house had six feet of water for probably two weeks, drained off, we washed the inside of it, and it's ready to live in, except for, except for um, um, electric. We have to rewire it. But it needs to be cleaned, and that's it. And this house, I'm sure, was made to flood. It can't, it, it's a house that breathes. It can't be, it can't be uh, tightened up so that it's, the air doesn't move in it. And it's a natural Louisiana house and will serve Louisianians for generations if no one uh, tries to make it into a contemporary, like a Macomb Depot house. That's, that's what it is.